Ben Bateman here for Red Carpet Report, hanging out at the 44th Annual Saturn Awards. Yeah, you too. Yeah, you guys look terrific. Look at these suits. You got the whole thing put together. I love it. So, uh, talk to me. East Coast guys, you know. Oh, yeah? Okay. Okay. Talk to me about the inception of this movie. Where'd the idea come from? Well, The Man from Earth Holocene, which is the movie we're nominated for tonight, is actually a sequel to a movie we were nominated for 10 years ago. Really? Uh, called The Man from Earth, Jerome Bixby's The Man from Earth, which was written by a legendary science fiction author, Jerome Bixby, who worked on the original Star Trek, original Twilight Zone. He wrote Fantastic Voyage. Um, so we made that movie. It became, thanks to illegal downloading and piracy, it became <laughs> yeah. a huge worldwide phenomenon. Wow. Uh, and people were always asking about a, uh, you know, a sequel or a TV series. And so we made a movie to kind of double as a, a pilot for a proposed series. And that's what Holocene is, and it's out right now. And uh, we're now honored to be nominated. And, um, you know, it's we're still trying to get the, the word out about, uh, you know, pitching it as a TV show. So talk to me a little bit about the challenge of securing funding for a project like this. When you want to put this thing together, you have the idea. How, how difficult is that kind of a process when you're not dealing with, obviously, like a tentpole franchise movie, but you're dealing with something that's a real passion project, you know has an audience, but you have to get that funding? Well, the, the first one was a, a little harder. We pieced it together a little bit at a time. And then with this one, given the success of the first one, and the uh, you know over, over the last decade sort of came this pretty big cult hit, uh, it was a little easier this time around uh, that we found somebody that uh, really liked the first one and, and, and you know, uh, was impressed with the, uh, the returns for it. And We also did some crowdfunding yeah. uh, on this one. That's true. We actually That's got right. started. The first sort of fifty, sixty thousand dollars $60,000 that we got in for the movie was actually crowdfunding. Do you find that the, uh, the, the sort of scattered nature of digital distribution has hurt or helped stuff in your sort of cult genre? We're going to find out really soon uh, because we haven't got our first reports back from the digital sales, but we're going to get that any minute. But we've actually done something really interesting with this movie. Remember I told you how the first one yeah. suffered? Uh, well, we suffered from piracy. The movie didn't suffer. The movie got spread around the world. This time, since we knew it was going to happen, we actually uploaded it ourselves to the pirate ecosystem with a little message at the beginning saying go to manfromearth.com and make a donation if you're watching this movie without paying for it. Yeah, you guys are like Radiohead. That's crazy. That's awesome. Yeah. And, and, and so about six, 7,000 people around the world so far in the last couple of months have sent in donations. Wow. I mean, and I mean from everywhere, China, Russia, all over Europe, America, awesome. South America. Amazing. Well, congratulations, gentlemen. Thank awesome. You, awesome. Thank you. Good luck. Nice talking to you. Yeah, you as well. Thank you. And that's a wrap at the 44th Annual Saturn Awards. Thanks for hanging out with us, guys. We'll see you next year. If you like this video, give it a quick thumbs up, subscribe, and of course, leave your thoughts in the comments on what were your favorite interviews, what were your favorite questions. See you guys next time.